Hey everyone, it's VVV Tutorials VVV here, making a tutorial on how to get a virtual desktop manager to have four desktop, four desktops. Um, it's gonna show you how to have how to if you're if you're a multitasker, this would be good for you. It only works on Windows XP, so if you don't have Windows XP, then won't work for you, but I, uh, yeah. If you have Windows 7, then I will be showing you how to get, uh, I will be making another tutorial soon on how to get Virtual Desktop Manager for Windows 7. But just like this one, except you could have more than four desktops. Um, so what you're going to want to do first is you're going to want to open up your internet browser. Mine is Google Chrome. If you guys have something else, it's okay. Um, you're going to, uh, one sec, let me let it load. Sorry about my internet, it's a little slow right now, uh, especially with this computer. It's not really that fast. Um, need to get a new graphics card, new more RAM. I actually need to get a new motherboard first. Uh, but anyway, beside, that's beside the fact. Okay, so first on Google, you're going to want to type Microsoft Power Toys. That will be in the description on what you need to type in, and then you just hit enter. Um, I can't really see my mouse right now, so if I'm, if it takes me a second to click on something, it's because I can't really see it. But I know you guys can, because yeah, mine's like all blinky, blinking, and I've tested this before. It is not for you. So after you do that, you're you're gonna wanna click on the first link. It says Microsoft Power Toys for Windows XP. And uh, you're going to want to scroll all the way down. And you're going to see Virtual Desktop Manager right here. Right, sorry, right here. So then you're going to want to go to the side and go down about three. And you'll see Virtual Desktop Manager, Deskman.exe, 550KB, three, three minute, well mine says three minute at 2.28 KB per second. P, B, P, S, whatever. And then you're going to want to click on it and uh, open it and in, ex install it. Um, I already have it, but I'll do it anyway. I've tried to download this more than once for this tutorial, but it wouldn't let me. Um, so, yeah. Um, uh, as this is going, I'm just going to tell you guys. Um, Soon, I'm. I think I'm gonna be getting a webcam, so I'm gonna be doing. I'm. I think I'm gonna start vlogging. Um, should start vlogging soon, so I think I'm gonna get more subscribers before I do that, though. Uh, so yeah, it's gonna be pretty cool. So I'm gonna have start doing more tutorials now that I have that. So after you open it, see it says I already have it. I'm gonna press no. Um, you're going to want to just install the whole thing, and then after it's done installing, you're going to want to go to your toolbar, and you're going to want to right-click on it. Sorry, I... It's just... Okay, there we go. You're going to want to right-click on your toolbar, you're going to want to go to toolbars, then you're going to want to click desktop manager. Then that will activate it, and then that's really all you have to do. You have four desktops. If you want to change the background of each desktop like I do, here, let me show you, give you guys an example. One sec, I, like I said, I can't see my mouse. There we go. Okay, I have different, um, one second. It's loading, okay. I have four different backgrounds for each one. If you want to know how to do that, then you go to your, any of your desktops, right click on where the buttons are, and go to, go to config, configure desktop images. And then you could click each image for each one. And uh, when you're also on this menu, you're going to want to uncheck Use Animations. It makes everything run a little bit smoother. And Share Desktops. Um, as you can see right now, I have these two windows open. Uh, I have Google Chrome open. And I have Recording, which is my Camtasia. Camtasia, sorry. And you're going to, and as you see, if I go to the second screen, whoops, if I go to the second screen, one second, it will load. Okay. If I go to second screen, it's not there. 
that's that's what shared desktop means. If uh, if you have that on, it will not let you do. Um, if you have that on shared desktops, it will still stay the windows here. It will just minimize them. But if you don't have it on, then it will take them away. Look like this is a brand new desktop. Nothing here. It's a good way to like fool your friends. I don't know. <laughs> so um, yeah, um, that's basically how to get four desktops. So, uh, I hope you guys like this tutorial. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. If you have any questions, email me in the email below. Um, um, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. If you'll probably, you probably saw this at the beginning of the video, but down at the very right corner, one second, down at the very right corner, down right down here um down the very bottom right corner um you could click any on every video that i make right there will be where you can go to see my go to straight to my channel just by clicking on that um and i have all my videos yeah really cool um if you guys have any requests on tutorial i should tutorials i should do please leave me a comment or message me telling me um, I check my email more often than anything, so, yes, if you could email me, that'd be great, too. So, I hope you guys like this tutorial. Thank you for watching. Peace out.